Esports can also be educational and just not like for fun and video games. 30 plus years ago, when video games were brought into the world, we were told the video games were bad for us. Fast forward to today, and they are the forefront in educational learning and competition, not only in the classroom, but up through the branches of our armed forces. At South Sand High School, Bobcat Esports sponsor Domingo Ruiz Jr. has built a strong foundation for the organization. The students are excited, and it's, if it wasn't for the students, we wouldn't have it. You know, I want to say, you know, it's been easy to work with them uh, because esports just brings out the excitement for them. Ruiz has developed a sponsor relationship with Port San Antonio community partners, SAMSAT and TechPort, which has also caught the attention of the United States Army Esports program. In providing our students in high schools with options and opportunities to help elevate them is critical. A recent meeting discussed the newest collaboration of adding JROTC to esports. This initiative has opened a door to expanding an esports athlete's career path after graduation. When they graduate, whether they go on to higher education, whether they decide to go out to the workforce and develop a career, or whether they decide to go into the military. Planning has started to host an esports educational tour via the U.S. Army and community sponsors, where it will showcase local districts' esports teams, as well as the Army, Navy, Air Force, and Marine esports teams. If we can get the uh, the United States Army eSport trailer here to participate in this event. It's going to be outstanding. I that they want to partner with us and do an event, a large event here on this side of town and, and to see our program, our students leading it is, is exciting. 